Take your head out of the sand. It's time. Oh, put your head between your legs and kiss that ass goodbye. You are now being programmed by... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know who it is. Your boy Hero from Miami. Coming to you live from where? You know where. Miami. <laughs> Producer. Yo, sorry I'm late. I had to pull over on the way here. My goodness. Man, I had to piss like a pony. Like a pony. Like a pony. <laughs> Yo, that Starbucks coffee runs through me like water. Is it what? Glyphosates? I hope not. <laughs> Yo, on the topic of Starbucks, would someone mind enlighten me as to why these people that have a business built around beverages only have two bathrooms in the building? As though everyone dining in is not going to have to pee pee at some point or another, if not all at once. Unbelievable. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Yo, if I ever develop a urinary tract infection as a result of their lack of lavatories, somebody up the ladder will be hearing from my lawyers. It's absolutely ludicrous. Lord. Yo, wasn't the CEO of that company running for president, like, just recently or attempting to? Right? Yo, I'm glad he dropped out of the race. That would have been a damn disaster. <laughs> so anyways, while I'm pissing, the little telescreen on the wall in front of me, in the urinal, is promoting the most propaganda. Seriously. You can't even take a piss in peace nowadays without them trying to pipe something down your throat. Why are you laughing? You think I'm joking? Some total recall, demolition man, three seashell shit going on out here. But I digress. So whatever, the thing they were showing was about the Grammys. <laughs> Can't escape it. Joaquin Phoenix. Okay, apparently he was having some type of Joe Biden moment. <laughs> yeah. Attempted to describe this to you really wouldn't do this moment in time any justice. So let me just show it to you. <laughs> Producer, look at this. Roll the clip! And the Oscar goes to... Joaquin Phoenix Joker. All right, well, congratulations on this that one. This is the first Oscar and fourth nomination for Joaquin Phoenix. Fourth nomination, what was, what was the other fourth? Hi. Yo, so, I like that background uh, music, though. Um, <clears throat> God, I'm full of so much gratitude right now. Uh, and I do not feel elevated above any of my fellow nominees you or anyone in this room because we you're, share you're the, you're the, the same scum love of the with the love of film. And this form of expression has given me the most extraordinary life. Yeah. Oh, that's um, well, I don't good know for what you. I'd be without it. But I think the greatest gift that it's given me, and many of us in this room, is the opportunity to use our voice for the voiceless. The voiceless? I've been thinking a lot about some of the distressing issues that we are yeah. facing collectively. Shit is really distressing out here, my boy, for and us normal poor people. I think we feel or we're made to feel that we champion different causes. But for me, I see commonality. Commonality. I think whether we're talking about Add gender that to equality the or racism or queer rights <laughs> or indigenous rights or animal rights, we're talking about the fight against injustice. Mm. We're talking about the fight against the belief that one nation, one people, one race, one gender, mm. or one species has the right to dominate, control, and use and exploit I like to another dominate. with impunity. I, Alpha <laughs> male. I like to dominate. Thank you. Um, I think that we've become very disconnected from the natural world. Mm -hmm. And many of us, what we're guilty of is an egocentric worldview 
mm. the belief that we're the center of the universe. I am. We go into the natural world and we plunder it for its resources. I do. We feel entitled to I artificially am. inseminate a cow. <laughs> and when she gives birth, we steal her baby. <laughs> even though her cries of anguish are unmistakable. It is. It and is. then we take her milk that's intended for a calf <laughs> and we put it in our coffee but and our cereal. But it is. We fear the this. idea of personal change. Are you guys out there hearing this? Because we think that we have to sacrifice something to give something up. But human beings at our best are so inventive and creative and ingenious. And I think that when we use love and compassion as our guiding principles, we can create, develop, and implement systems of change that are beneficial to all sentient beings and to the environment. Sentient beings. Now, I've been... Yep, clap it up. I've been a scoundrel in my life. Yes! I've been selfish. I've been cruel at times. So have I. Hard to work with and ungrateful. So have I. But so many of you in this room have given me a second chance. No and more chances. No best. more chances. As for him. When, when we support each other, not when we cancel each other out for past mistakes, but when we help each other to grow, when we educate each other, when we guide each other towards redemption. That is the best of humanity. That's the best thing you said all night. I just, I want to, um, when you, when. Spit it out. Come on. When, when, he, was, when, he, was, when he was 17, my brother wrote this lyric. Oh. He said, run to the rescue with love and peace will follow. Thank you. Thank you. Wrap it up, B. Yo. You yeah. see what I mean? Produce it. I know we're busy flirting with the edge of the entire collapse of civilization and everything, but, but I have a small inquiry I would like to make. Is it just me or are certain people going above and beyond to usher in the end of society. <laughs> Yo, do me a favor. Yo, call Monster. Yo, give her the coordinates to the bunker and the password to the door and the other gun that I bought for her as well. If I die out there, she's in charge, all right? Katie, Katie, bar the door! Bar the fucking door. Unless you want to be a victim. Do you know what the word Victimology means? Katie. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Victimology. Victimology. The study of the ways in which the behavior of crime victims may have led to or contributed to their victimization. The claim that the problems of a person or group are the result of victimization. The study of the victims of crime and the psychological effects on them of their experience. Victimology. 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 Victimology.